What are you doing? Getting rid of those nasty knots? Yep. Hey Logan, can I make a suggestion? Maybe you're already doing this. Uh, cut it into maybe eight, yeah, three or four lengths and we'll just carry it out with a grapple. I knew you'd do that. Marking these out, Logan, like uh, figure out, you know, where 36 inches is, maybe, cut, I don't know, get the most out of the log, you know. There you go, exactly. That's some quick measuring. Whoop! Bring the whole clam. You had that bent one. The problem with this thing is one is bent, and then then you run into problems grabbing everything. But we'll see. See, now it, it grips uh, the bent one and won't grab the front. There, perfect, Logan. Perfect. Grip it again and pick it up. That's what you got to do. You got to pinch it in there. That's perfect. I wouldn't do a thing other than uh, gripping it once in a while. Hit the hydraulic uh, close. You got them in there. If you want to run them out to the log pile, you can. Okay. That's my new logging trail back up through here. We got a bunch of oak uh, down back there. I want to cut up. Just a matter of getting back there. But it's all down on the ground, dead. Good wood. We're going under what I call the golden arches. So, yeah, I was saying this is the golden arches. I call the golden arches, uh, Logan. This double tree fell down about two years ago. Uh, this one here was laying across the logging trail and I cut up. But this one here is still alive, I think, unless it died this winter. But it, uh, it was, it's, we just kind of let it grow. It's kind of cool. I think it's still alive. All right, go look at those cherries. I'll follow you. Yeah, that cherry fell about, uh, I don't know. Wow, okay. This winter, early, yeah. Yep. There's the deer stand. I haven't cut any of these cherries since they've fallen, Logan. I've been meaning to get back here, and they're uh, they're ready to roll. Get them out of here. They're great wood before they rot. This cherry's broke off up top right there and there. There's one top. Oh, I see what happened. What happened, buddy? back down so that looks like another tree but it's just it's just a log sticking into the ground right yep 
So that is going to be saved for a day when we can get the tractor back here, tie a rope around it, and get it off of there. I so think that, that I think that cherry next to you is pretty punky. Yeah. I based on. Uh, it, we better leave it for the bug. Yep. So, so just this log here, or actually just can, this piece here. I think we can, well... You can leave, I don't know if there's any wood in this piece. Logan, why don't you cut into it and see what you got? Yeah. See what, you, see what happens. Otherwise, we'll just let it lay. Hmm. Um... Uh, Yep, you got her. Just about, give it, just about ready to give advice and he figured it out. Logan's doing what's called making a safe area. Clean up all those twigs down there. Get all the leaning branches cut off. Anything in your way. Nice stuff, huh? If it's no good, just take the nice chunk. Hey! 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 It's easier to carry as it is. Just drive right in here and pick it up. Oh, it's only one good piece? Oh, wow. Okay, cool. Smarter than he looks. Okay. Cool beans. He just schooled me. Got rid of some crappy punky wood down here. Not even worth bringing out of the woods. Let it do its thing in the woods, right? So, as you saw, we got the base of this thing rotten. This one's rotten. That one is had ants crawling out of it, but oh, now that I look, that doesn't look very nice either. But we're gonna take that one right there, that one, that little one, and that one. So we got one, two, three, four logs that'll all easily fit in there in the grapple. And uh, we got this one, which is hung up. That isn't a tree. That's That broke off of that, shanked down here, stuck into the ground. So that'll be another video. We'll drag that out of there. So, eh, I kind of was hoping this was solid, but it's not. So no biggie. We got a little bit out of it. We're going to see if uh, Steve can creep through here with the, tr with the tractor. I don't know. Can he make it? That's a pretty tight hole there. We'll see, but we gotta go dump this basswood off first, so we'll see you back when Steve's back from dumping the basswood. There he is. All right. I don't know, I don't think it'll fit through the trees. I'm gonna have to grab the saw and cut it. There's no way. No, we're not. No. Have faith in me. I've got mad operating skills. You think that'll fit? Oh, it's gonna hit right here. No. Oh, I see what you're doing. Oh. He 
He's got mad skills, everybody. Maybe, maybe I caught too soon. Uh oh. You do some sharp turns. Yeah, maybe I caught too soon. Maybe you gotta drag him out. Ah. Uh -huh. Set him down. Oh, there you go. Drag him. Ta da! Now don't hit a tree. Baby logs. Baby logs. Alright. Are you taking that down today? Let's do it. We're taking yeah, this pole. You can set up for it. You ready for it? Yeah. Oh, I think we got enough gas. I filled it up before I got out here. Alright. I'm going to tip this one over and he's going to pick it up too. This is good solid cherry. Anything for cherry. If this was basswood, it'd be no deal. But cherry, you got to do it for the cherry, man. Come on now. Ooh, prickly, prickly, ah, prickly weeds out here. I'm getting my fingers, my gloves. All right, I'm gonna get the tripod. We're gonna take this little cherry pole down here. Beautiful. Gonna be good firewood. I hope it's solid though. We'll see here. All right, we're gonna get this buckthorn here out of the way. Safe working area. You gotta clear all the little trees around you so you got an escape route. Tree felling 101. But this is nothing. This is gonna. You got this no problem. Pretty easy. Tr pretty easy tree. No, no, no overhead. Check that out. Pretty clear. No document. No. Tractor. I could have had the tractor a little farther away, maybe, but yeah. Oh, come here. oh. nice. That's how wet it is. Nice. It's that like isn't gas, folks. That's water from the tree. That is crazy. <laughs> Smells like poop. <laughs> ah, that's kind of a nice, a sweet smell, actually. This is a beautiful log. Yeah, it's kind of a sweet smell. Nice log. Nice job on the cut, Logan. Thank you. All right. Gonna get rid of that end cookie. It's not much good to anybody. Hey, Logan. Oh. I thought you were gonna cut that end cookie off. No, I'm not that stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Get it out of here. 
That's some nice stuff. I don't know if that's rot or what in the middle, but oh, I love me some big cherry. This side's good. That's cool, the water dripping out of there. Yep, big cherry logs. We'll get this in a video for sure. Pick two? Two big ones? A couple of nice cherry logs we got out of the woods. More forward, Logan. Just fit between the true trees. I don't know, one of those uh, eight foot logs, six foot, or a 55 inch grapple. So, I don't know, you do the math. I'm not good at it.